Captain Charles van der Peer was born in Belgium on 25 March 1922. His father was a ship's master as were two of his uncles. After the death of his father, Captain van der Peer never once considered doing anything else with his life than to go to sea. He had a notable war record as a member of the Belgian resistance movement. After the war the captain was able to resume his seagoing career and, having done his initial cadet training between 1938 and 1940, he joined the company Maritime Belgi in 1944. Receiving his first command in 1950, he served as master on various vessels operated by CMB and, later, by SO tankers. He was always extremely proud of his time at sea and indeed he made reverence for the seafarer one of his guiding principles, when he later went into ship management. He reminded us that our ability to run ships safely and efficiently for owners depended first and foremost on the efforts of those on board. In 1973 he started his own company, Univan came from the name United van der Peer. From humble beginnings, with a shrewd sense of business, direction and foresight, over the subsequent 36 years he built up a major business founded on his guiding principles of thrift, very hard work and devotion to the seafarer. Captain van der Peer was a pioneer in ship management, and is sometimes called the father of ship management. In managing these ships he was one of the first to spot the great professionalism, brain power and work ethic of Indian seafarers for much of the 70s and 80s was insufficiently appreciated by ship owners in the developed world. Captain Van de Peer also had a great eye for talent and recruited many hugely talented people, many of them are Indians, both afloat and ashore, to work for him. Attracting clientele from over the world, Univan provides high-quality, low-cost ship management services, with the ever-fluctuating and volatile trends in the shipping industry. With his team of highly motivated and qualified professionals, Captain van der Peer successfully steered Univan through good times and bad and built up the company's reputation for being a formidable force in the world of ship management. The group has offices spread over the shipping and crewing centers of the world including Hong Kong, India, with offices in Delhi, Mumbai, Chennai, Kochi and Kolkata, Thailand, Myanmar, China, Philippines and Singapore. Captain was an extremely tough taskmaster, very sharp and spontaneous, but most of his subordinates were much the wiser as a result. During his last eight years he struck up a partnership with Fred Cheng, who had run a very large tanker company in the 80s and he was fond of thanking the fates that had brought them together. He was granted Jachatha Dairakuna Porn Level 4 status by the King of Thailand for so much charitable work. He donated many millions of baht to support education for Thai children, who had less opportunity to become educated by building several schools. He also helped improve police stations for Thai police, including donations of computers. He built temples and helped HIV-infected patients and built health care clinics in remote rural villages and arid areas of Thailand. As his widow, Kanika said it was terribly regretful to lose a good man like our captain but he will stay in our minds and in our memories forever. The well-known pioneer of ship management Captain Charles Arthur Joseph van der Peer, the founder-chairman of Univan Ship Management Limited, passed away peacefully in his 88th year, after a long illness on September 19, 2009 in Bangkok. Condolence message and tributes are pouring in from all over the world, as we go to the press. Captain van der Peer was synonymous not only with Univan, but also with professionalism and ship management. His guidance will surely miss by all.